Mark was my brother. We did not share the same blood. We did not share the same mother, though I generally do love her as my own. But we did share the same mission, to bring light to where there is darkness. And I've done that through creating this film, through helping share his story and the story of many of our Canadian men and women who are serving this country, and not just the soldiers, but the families, and not just the fallen, but those who are still serving today and, to continue, and who continue to serve. Art is an incredibly powerful medium. I created this film through my heart, and I hope it speaks to yours. One of the great things about art is that people can see it from their own perspective, whether it be through the eyes of the mother, through the eyes of the father, through the eyes of the comrade, the brother, the sister, the girlfriend. Each person who sees this film will see it from their own perspective, and as so, it will touch them. In addition to all those perspectives, there is one that is perhaps the most unique, it is that of the immigrant. We must not forget the sacrifices of those who came before us. The blood, the sweat, and the love. <coughs> Nationalism and pride for one's country is not something that is the domain of those who have been here first. It is something that belongs to everyone, something that is shared by all Canadians. Our good friend Rahib, who you saw recently in the video for the Highway of Heroes, specifically mentioned that Canada is a good country to die for. What did he mean when he said this? He meant that Canada upholds virtues. It commemorates the sacrifices of those who are here and continues to honor the legacy of those who will create our future. Canada is a country of nobility, a country that was created upon the foundations of immigrants. Thank you to all those who have helped do so. Mark Diab is a soldier, is the hero, is the citizen, as, all are, as are all of you. For you do not have to be a soldier to be a hero. Mark said this in the film. He said, or he expressed rather, that simply through loving those around you, you are the hero. You are the hero to those closest to you. Love thy neighbor. To just be the love you want to see in the world. That's the, that's, that is the light that will help illuminate the darkness. Mark had a premonition of his own death, but he also had a premonition of a future. A future where people act out of benevolence. So how do we honor that? How do we continue to honor the memory? We do that through our actions. We do that through our day-to-day -day words, through the love that we share. So to all the soldiers, to all the mothers, to all the fathers, the sons, the daughters, and the girlfriends, the boyfriends, the husbands, etc., etc., thank you for honoring the legacy, and thank you for being the heroes. Thank you.